board. Next up is for the Sustainability Middle East Champion of the Year Government Agency. Now, as we know, the UAE has pledged to reach net zero carbon emissions by 2050. Now, it plans to invest $163 billion in clean and renewable energy and key technologies. So we've seen some fascinating legislation come from a number of government agencies right across the country, as well as policies, programs and agendas to really drive this change. Let's take a look at our nominees. They are the Ministry of Energy and Infrastructure, the Ministry of Industry and Advanced Technology of the UAE, the Ministry of Climate Change and Environment in the UAE, the Ministry of Environment, Water and Agriculture of Saudi Arabia, and the Environment Agency, Abu Dhabi. And our winner is the Ministry of Climate Change and Environment in the UAE. change and environment here in the UAE has really been at the forefront of making a change, making an impact when it comes to climate action and really driving the entire country's efforts to achieve the country's net zero by 2050 strategic initiative. Now, due to prior engagements, Her Excellency Mariam al is not able to join us. However, we are delighted that His Excellency al Nawami is going to be receiving a trophy on her behalf. There. And I think Agents we have a special message. Building a sustainable future is our collective responsibility. The United Nations has launched a time human activity for the most highly vulnerable to climate progress is in our DNA. Maximum energy, minimum emissions. Building a sustainable future is our collective responsibility. Incorporating sustainability values and principles in our daily lives and business operations can go a long way when done on a large scale. Helping people see and believe they are agents of change has been a challenge that we work tirelessly to overcome through initiatives aimed at raising community awareness and sectoral engagement. We all can make an impact and contribute to putting the world on a sustainable path. Very inspiring message from Her Excellency there. And again, congratulations to the Ministry of Environment and Climate Change.